Wix Hotel Booking System Tutorial. Hello guys and welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a hotel booking website and how you can manage it using the Wix Hotels or the Wix Hotel Booking System. So it is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. So the first thing first is head over Wix.com. Once you are on Wix.com, sign in for an account. And as you can see, we have here, after we have signed in the site's dashboard, we have all the websites that we have created. So we are going to create a new website for this specific occasion, which is the hotels. So I'm going to click on create a new website. If you are not familiar with the Wix or uh, with their uh, platform and it is your first time creating the account on it, you're going to get this page, which will allow you to choose or get the choice about, between uh, the Wix Studio or the normal Wix editor. So I'm going to select the normal Wix editor. From here, you can go ahead and get the help of the AI if you want to uh, answer some questions and uh, rather customize your dashboard by answering the questions, or you can set it up without the chat. So here we have the type of the website that we want to create. Obviously, we are going to type in hotel and see the suggestion. So we have the hotel, hotel bar, design studio, whatever. So I am going to set up here a hotel like that. I am going to click on continue and we are going to proceed to the dashboard. So it is going to be preparing our dashboard. We're going to see here some few things and the most important thing is right there is to set up the name and also the features that we need into our uh, right there, uh, website. So Jack Hotel, for example, click on continue. Here you are going to set up the Wix apps that you need. We are going to see that it is built in a Wix Hotels app you can manage and grow your hospitality business i'm going to add here a booking and an instagram feed so you can go ahead and add more and discover more apps by clicking on them and set them as much as you want but i will not do that i'm going to click on continue here i have the access to my dashboard now so basically you can go ahead and complete the different steps right there by getting uh, a domain or a custom domain right there. You can add the first room type from here, set up the online payment methods, of course, design your website, get found on Google, uh, which is a very attractive right there by uh, setting up or installing your hotel or your website into the search engine of Google. And here we have it. Now you can go ahead and click on design site. And it will take you right there to this specific area. So you are going to either generate a design with the AI or customize a template right there. I'm going to pick up here a random template, not very random, but we are going to use one that will satisfy our need. So basically I'm going to select this one. Its name is hotel, so it doesn't matter. We're going to select it. Now we have the uh, website or the template which is going to be loading in a few seconds we are going to give it some time and we are going to be back to it so here we have the uh, website or our hotel website ready you can get here a quick tour guide for uh, this specific area for adding elements adding section managing the pages and menus and etc and here we have it you can go ahead and click on any of these elements and normally you can go ahead and get the zoom in for that so we have i think a fancy right there uh hotel website we have all the necessary pages for booking online contact activities about the hotel book a room option and etc so you can go ahead and click on pages and menus and see here the different uh or their uh, elements. So for the book room or their page, we have something different, which is going to be here special for Wix. So we have here the uh, uh, the uh, rooms, the 
are available so we are going to modify them set up the uh dimensions of them the uh, supporting uh, or the members uh, that are allowed in that room and etc so we are going to filter those and set up them as much as you want now let's go ahead and refresh the site's dashboard page so i need something to do in here which is selecting the uh, dashboard of that website we need it for uh, later and here we are going to click on the apps not just this app but the uh, app with the gear icon. So we are going to click on it and it will show up right there, the businesses or my businesses that I have in this website. So we have the Wix booking, which is installed. You can go ahead and create your service from here. For the booking, you're going to set up the scheduling platform, the calendar and the online booking for your customers to book a room. So, we have the forms and payments. We do not need that. Uh, need that Wix chat, not interested, but the Wix hotel or Wix hotels are interesting. So you can update your Wix hotels, manage the rooms, manage the extras, manage the pages, add a hotels elements from here. So I'm going to uh, set up here or update your uh, my app. Uh, this is the first thing. And the second thing is going to be manage the rooms it will show up right there the dashboard that is going to be containing the hotels so here we have the room types the right plans uh, or the rate plans etc so i'm going to click on start now it will start installing and authorizing the app to work properly so i'm going to click on agree and add so basically it will add up right there the uh wix hotels right away I'm going to wait for the add-in and we are going to give a try. So you can manage with this app the coupons and etc. So I'm going almost here. So we are going to go to the editor. I don't know why, but we are already on the editor. So we are going to give a try. I'm going to wait. So basically we are going to set up the property name and also the property type. Is it a BNB, a bed and breakfast, an apartment, a guest house, hotel, and etc. So I'm going to set up here the property or the room type. For example, it is going to be something, I don't know, you are going to choose from there. I'm going to set it as an apartment, for example. I'm going to click on here, create the room type. So we are going to set up the kind of room. Apartment, bungalow, business room, classic room, for example. I'm going to click on next. Here we are going to set up the display name, for example. Uh, here we are going to set up a double room with a nice C view, for example, view like that. The capacity we are going to set up to adults and a number of rooms uh, since it is a little apartment we are going to set up here at least two rooms the revenue accountant account is accommodation as standard i'm going to click on next you are going to set up the price or the base price of the room so we are going to set it at 60 dollars for example uh shoes number of adults set the base price for what uh occupancy so two guest calculation price calculation for one guest is going to be uh for example let's say here i don't know uh 15 percent two guests i'm going to set or put it here if you want so i'm going to click on next here we are going to uh, set up the amenities for example the popular amenities beach view for example a sea view city view also maybe a pool view for it go ahead and select one of the smoking condition for example non-smoking the bed types you're going to set up here the bed types here are going to set it as double also a king bed the room views for example bay and i don't know uh, something like that the room feature 
kitchenette, for example, balcony, uh, bathroom window, mosquito net, uh, a carpet, a carpeted floor, and etc. Bathroom with shower, with uh, jacuzzi. I don't know. You are going to be free to add that. We have the electronics, the domestic appliances, ventilation and air conditioning. Of course, for example, like that. The room amenities. So you are going to choose those. Click on next, and here we have the photos. Finally, you are going to set up the photos and complete the setup by start selling this room. For example, choose a Dutch store, a date to start, and also a date to end. Uh, then you are going to click on save. For example, here I'm going to put it here to this, for example, a week or seven days or eight days. You're going to click on save. Boom. So you can see here with that we have the property settings, the room types that you have, the rate plans, the extras. Here it will take a little bit of time to set up the master rate, for example, here. The extras, we have the tax categories, the markets, for example. You have the revenue accounts, the promotion codes, languages, property management. Also, you can manage the uh, property manage management for the reservation calendar, the inventory calendar, the channel manager, and etc. So, this is how you can work with the Wix Hotels. And here we have it. So, that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.